kindly make sure the software version of DJI Terra is at least 3.0.0 before the point cloud post-processing. Insert the SD card of the Zenmuse L1 into the computer and copy the data acquired by the Zenmuse L1 to the local computer. Launch DJI Terra, create a LiDAR point cloud processing mission, edit the mission name, and save it. Select and import the raw data into DJI Terra software. The data acquired each time will be stored in a folder named in this format. DJI Year Month Day Hour Minute Underscore Sequence Number Underscore Custom Underscore Name Please import the JPEG images as well if you would like to process true color point clouds. Select the point cloud density. High means 100% of point clouds will be processed, while medium is 25%, and low is 6.25%. Click Output Coordinate System Settings, and select the appropriate Output Coordinate System and Height System. Set Point Cloud Effective Distance, where point clouds at a distance exceeding that value from the LiDAR will be filtered out after post-processing. Click Parameters, and enable the Optimize Point Cloud Accuracy option to ensure greater consistency and accuracy of point cloud scanned at different moments. Click Reconstruction Output and select the formats of the point cloud you would like to have after post-processing. Click the Start Processing button to start post-processing. Once the point cloud processing is completed, the overall point cloud results will display on the left side of the software. Switch different point cloud coloring modes by selecting between RGB, Intensity, Height, and Echoes. Click Annotation and Measurement to measure the coordinates of any point, the distance between any two points, and the area or volume of any multiple points in the point cloud results. Return to the mission library, select the mission name, and click the folder icon to open the mission results folder. The point cloud results in last format are stored under Terra underscore last folder, and the files with the dot out suffix are trajectory files of INS-IMU, which can be imported into third-party softwares for further analysis.